today we're going to be making our very own ocean drum. Yeah. For those of you who don't know what an ocean drum is, here's a real ocean drum that I have. Well, you can already start to hear the sound of it. <laughs> this is a beautiful Remo ocean drum. It's which making already me tired. It's making you tired already. It's actually a relaxation instrument and it just sounds like the ocean. And this one is beautiful. That's why it's called an ocean drum. Yeah. This one's beautiful because it's got an underwater scene. So it's got fish and coral and seaweed and it's very beautiful. And if you want to hear what it sounds like, have a listen. Oh, it sounds like the ocean. <laughs> we know that a gentle ocean sound is very soothing and when you play it it's so even tired. more relaxing <laughs> so we're going to make our very own ocean drum because we want it to be see-through so that we can see our ocean scene i've just found a tupperware container i also found lots of these little colorful beads and there are some metal beads. The ones in the real ocean drum are metal and that's the sound they make is because they're metal. Why are metal? See, we've got some metal beads as well. Oh, yeah. And some colorful beads. So what we're gonna do is just drop them in. Yeah. We're gonna just drop all the beads in. So if you're lucky and like, like us and have lots of little round beads. Even glitter if you No, there's oh. a bit of glitter in there because they were mixed in with the beads. But let's hear how that sounds because basically this is our ocean drum for the sound. Do you mm -hmm. wanna try it? See if it sounds similar to the other one. Yeah. I'm going to do it really quietly so I fall asleep. We're going to actually be playing it upside down. If you're working with really young children um, and you're doing it upside down, like it maybe might, three or four or five. Maybe three or four or five year olds, you might want to actually tape it closed so that you're not pulling the lid off and then getting beads everywhere right yeah, that'd be very bad because then you would have to stop doing what you're doing and then tidy it all up and yeah, then keep right. doing it and it'll be night time by the time you tidy all those beads up that's right because they're teeny tiny <laughs> and obviously we don't want to be using them around babies mm, babies will be bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah so or any children under three so it's gonna sound like that So we wanted to make our ocean drum look pretty just like this one. Mm -hmm. So I cut a piece of paper the size of the lid and then Marley on the other side on the other side drew a beautiful underwater scene. So it's a great arts and crafts activity and Marley actually used um, like water pencils. Water pencils. So you dip the pencils in water and then you colour with them. Yeah, so it came out really well. It's so we've just put some blue tack on around the edges. Yeah. Because I might want to still use this container for something. Like for food or something. For food. So I don't want to be gluing it on. You might want to glue it on if you... If you, you could wanna... sticky tape it or glue it if you don't really like that container anymore. That's right. So we're just going to stick... With the blue tack we've put on there, we're just going to stick this underwater scene onto the top, which is actually going to be the bottom of our ocean drum. So now that we've stuck on our picture, our ocean drum is complete. It's and it looks pretty. It is so beautiful. And it looks like this. It's got beautiful coloured beads inside. It's got an underwater scene. And it sounds like the ocean. Marley, are you falling asleep? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> See, it really works. <laughs> it's like a sleeping potion. It's like a sleeping potion. So, there you have it. Our beautiful ocean drum out of a clear Tupperware container, 
some beautiful colored beads and an arts and, and crafts project of making an underwater scene to make it look beautiful. And if you put it next to the original ocean drum, looks pretty good, hey? Thanks for watching. See you for our next video.